Hello and welcome to Lorefent Gaming Plays Days Gone. I am your host Lorefent and today's Days Gone video we're going to get revenge on the Rippers and we're going to be fighting Carlos via boss fight style. As always like, comment, and subscribe to my channel for more of Days Gone content like this. So now what we're going to do is speak with Boozer and yes we're going to go back into Rippers territory and get some serious revenge. Here we go. Nice rifle. Oh, yeah, a little present from Schizo. Remind me to be there when you give it back to him. He'll be there. That goddamn Schizo. So what are we gonna do with the bastard? I mean, we're not letting Iron Mike put him on trial, are we? No, we're not! All right, so what's the plan? I know the area pretty well. Sarah, uh, she worked out of a lab south of Iron Butte Ranch. I used to ride out there, pick her up for lunch. Harder to ride on some of those back roads. Jesse, Carlos, whatever the hell he's calling himself. He's taken over the old golf course and resort. Just south of the lodge is the Crescent Lake Reservoir. Now we blow that dam, that lake's gonna flood down into the valley and it's gonna drown them all, like rats. Okay, but isn't the lodge up on a hill? Yeah. Yeah, flood probably won't do much to it, but it'll do enough damage to the rest of the Ripper compound to take out most of his men. And if Jesse survives, you won't see us coming. You got it. Now we just gotta figure out how to get into the Iron Butte Valley without being seen, yeah? I'll get us there. Hang on. Ripper patrol. I see him. Rippers. This is in my arm. This is for you. That was a lot of dialogue, a lot of combat, a lot of stuff to do. However, it's all said and done for now. We're uh, clearing out the Rippers one by one, and we're having a good time doing it. All right, some free ammo, smoke bombs, and bandages. That's good. Yes, yeah, so this is basically a payback mission. You see, what's going to happen is we're going to hit the Rippers very hard, and then we're going to hit their leader the hardest. This one was one of my uh, personal favorites, too. I felt like there was a lot of things going on at once, it kept you busy, plus it was a lot of fun to do. Also I love payback missions. This game has some good payback missions, just trust me. Alright, I am done looting up the uh, joint and I'm going to grab a Boozer and we're going to ride on ahead. Yeah, Boozer had to stay in the background while I uh, did the dirty work still. Boozer did a good job of watching my bike, that was important. Yeah, I would uh, drive very slowly here since there's a lot of cars. Unless you want to go uh, look for scraps, which isn't good at all. 
Still, I'm going to move a little bit slow, make sure everything is all right. We're almost back into Ripper's territory to destroy things. We gotta head south from here. Following you. <laughs> yes, I am definitely going to get some revenge on uh, Carlos and the Rippers. Yeah, Carlos is the one who uh, burnt my arm up. Yeah, that's considered major payback. I do mean some serious major uh, payback. So now we're going to drive to the destination where we want. Now, this is optional. We uh, pass the ramp. If you want to do that, that's fine. You don't get anything out of it except for uh, photo mode uh, screenshots. And if you're in a photo mode, do some neat jumps in this game and then uh, put on social media. It's pretty cool, though. They did a great job of uh, photo mode in this game. So now while I'm talking, I'm getting closer to the destination. Once we arrive, then I'm going to see what's uh, going down. easy. Nope. Okay. Hey, what are you doing? Figured I'd take this bag of explosives down there and ask him if they didn't mind us, you know, blowing them the fuck up. Boozer. Look, you stay up here with Skizzo's rifle and keep them off me while I set the charges. Oh, hold, hold on. Look, I got this. I'm not much good in a firefight, but I can plant these charges. I've set demo charges before, Boozer, in Afghanistan. I know exactly where to put them. Good. Tell me where to go when I'm down there. We doing this? Yeah. All right. Okay, power should give me a good. I'll wait here until you get up there. All right, this is very simple. Protect Boozer while you're snipering. Real easy. I do mean really easy if you're a sniper. Stay low, move fast. You got it, brother. Loser! Never mind. Go, go! No! What do I set the first charge? You see the second set of scaffolding on top of the dam? Okay. Stock, the big pipe at the base of the dam. Ah, got it. I'm 
heading there now. Charge. In position. Just move your ass. Okay, you try doing this with one hand and a blade. Hey, come on, man. Sometimes I wish I had a blade hand. See? Easy as hell. You got this? Wait a minute, was this already? <laughs> <laughs> well, that never gets old, does it? Uh. Let's, uh, let's go find Jesse. Alright, so that's good right there. Now we have to go to a Ripper's compound and clear it out next. We uh, flooded the Ripper's land, took out many of the Rippers, probably some Freakers on the way too. So that's like a two for one right there I say. So now next up is we're going after the uh, Rippers. Yes folks, going back to the compound, we're going to clear them all out and it's going to be some major payback. So here we uh, go. Brother, you up? Uh... You did a hell of a job back there. Yeah? Yeah, I thought I was done for a couple of times. Yeah, I'm sorry about that. What the hell are you talking about? This is the most alive I've felt since... Uh, shit. You remember when we got trapped by that horde in Tumalo? We ain't done yet. How many do you think we killed? I don't know. They had it coming, right? Yeah, they had it coming. Guess we all do. Alright, looks like we go in on foot from here. You wanna stay? Keep any stray rippers from ripping off my bike? Yeah, I don't think we need to worry about that. And fuck that. This? This is on Jesse. You wanted some payback? I'm gonna show him some fucking payback. Come on, let's head to the lodge. Like I said, right behind you. Jesus. This must be what it looked like after Noah's flood. Came and washed away all the wicked. Yeah, except God had nothing to do with this one. Yeah. You get my point. Oh, shit. More rippers. How the hell did they survive? Oh, they didn't. They just don't know it yet. Deke! Our left! Our left! Yeah, yeah, I got this. Alright, real quick. I do need to clear this area out before reaching uh, Carlos to destroy him. So, here's some fun on that.
here! He's here! Yeah! Kill him! The Bruiser was a nice addition to kill, and he was fun to kill too. I believe he was taking out some foes too on the way. Probably some Ripper foes off screen, and that was great right there. Still, that's some nice ammunition there. Nice uh, Bruiser's ears, which is good for bounties. Probably gonna turn that into Iron Mike's camp. So next up, we're gonna go over here to the uh, marker right here, while I'm looting the bodies to uh, start uh, clearing out Carlos's uh, inner circle. I should probably say personal royal guards. Or whatever they call the Rippers, uh, best of the best. Well, either way, they're going to die, and it's going to be all good. So now I'm going to go up the stairs and check everything out. So here we go. These guys seem more jacked up than usual. Hell yeah. They must have snorted up the rest of whatever the hell drug they take. One last thing is uh, as soon as I enter this door, we're going to face Kalos. There's no way you're getting up there. <laughs> God. God damn it. Here. Listen, that is not Carlos up there, okay? Not this founder, rest in peace. It's fucking Jesse Williamson. Fucking low-life piece of shit scumbag who got what was coming to him. All right. Now you fucking go up there and kill that son of a bitch. Jesse Wilson brought low all 
Do you remember back in the day? You and Boozer held me down. But Jack burned the flesh from my back. Those... Those memories... Kept me from being free. Jack... Jack thought I was crazy. But I knew... I knew... I was one of you! But... But you see what you did? You see the scars on my flesh? The scars that kept me from being found. Yeah, that's it! Then I knew! I was about... Good being on this shit again, you know. I gotta say, shoveling shit and you know, pulling weeds. I know maybe it isn't such a bad way to spend the day. Yeah. Well, with Jesse gone, how many do you think are left? People that we knew from before, I mean. No one. Boo, so there's no one left. Shut. Sorry. Uh, yeah. Me too. Come on, let's get the yeah, fuck out of here. Well, like I said, I... I know we haven't talked in a few years. I guess I disfigured with my Elizabeth being there with you and all. There probably wasn't much point in me yammering away at you. Now and then. And what with all hell breaking loose, I, I thought maybe you weren't there. Or you just didn't give a shit. Pardon my language. I guess that's why I'm here. Say, I still don't know. I hope you're there. I hope there's some reason for all this shit we're living through. That's all. We'll, we'll, we'll talk again some other time. Oh, um, amen. Deke? Uh, <clears throat> yeah, Ricky told me that I could find you here. Oh! Uh, ah, it's just these knees of mine, you know. It's reason I haven't been praying all these years. Yeah, I'm not a... I'm not a church-going type. Even after living through that shitstorm in Sherman's camp. But now... After all this, I just thought, hell, I, maybe it, now it's the time. I, uh, I didn't have a choice, Mike. Oh, everybody's got a choice, Deke. Until they're dead. It's either us or them. <laughs> it's always us or them. Always. You know the reason we're going to hell? 
is we can't figure out that us is every goddamn soul that ain't walking around in shit-stained pants trying to eat us. All right, you know what? You may not like it, but the world is what it is. Yeah, it is. Praying ain't gonna change that. Wishing that it was something else ain't gonna make it that way, Mike. Wishing ain't got anything to do with it. We make the world what it is by what we do. All of us. I let him go. Schizo. Ain't no way he was getting a fair trial. You let him go. Told him to ride out, not come back. <sighs> Jesus Christ, Mike, do you have any idea what the fuck you've done? Yeah. I stopped another killing. And you know what? I guess I'm good with that. Now, with Carlos dead, everything's all good, set, and done. And we also completed uh, Keep Him Safe, which is good right here. We got some nice skins for the custom bike and many more uh, rewards right there. Well, that is it for uh, today's Days Gone video. This is uh, Lord Fenton signing off. Please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.